Oh goodness, I can hear myself. That must mean it is time for a Let's Play Super Mario 64. This is part 12, and I'm gonna get one more star, and I gotta show you guys something. Uh, Chess in the Current. This isn't a hard star to get. Um, I didn't practice it before I started it, which might have been wise, but I mean, when have I ever been wise with this Let's Play? I mean, that's yet to happen. So, yeah. Anyways, I, um, the reason I'm actually... This is going to be uploaded probably right after part 34 of Turok. Is because I feel like alternating between LPs for once as opposed to uploading just Turok. So I'm going to try to do that. I'm going to try to start updating as often as possible. Because I don't want Turok to reach the one year marker. Which I think it already has technically. But technically it hasn't because... The last, the first actual technical Let's Play video I uploaded of it was in August-ish. But the thing is, is that I hadn't actually started it at that point. It was just kind of like an introduction to the game itself or whatever. So I never really actually started the Let's Play. I actually started it right after 1080 in about September. Probably around after my birthday, which was the 23rd. Um, so we'll have to see how that works out. Um, I, I kind of want to get it done before it reaches that one year mark. So I'm going to start hustling with those uploads. I've now recovered 50 power stars. Uh, have I found all the cap switches, red, green, and blue? No, I have not. Hurry along now. The path is just ahead. So now we're going to go check out what this 50 star crap is. Now that I have a third key, or a second key I should say. And we're going to go check out this uh, place. Nice scared, no ghosts. Ain't never scared. Ain't ever, ever scared. Alright. So, we're just gonna head right on in here. Open the shit up. Uh, and now we're gonna walk up this red staircase of something I don't even know. Hmm. Do, do. Alright. Um, and we're gonna walk up this red staircase. A lot of red staircases in this, uh, here castle pretty intense I think we're just I'm not doing any of these levels yet these levels are more fun than the levels we're doing right now but we're not doing these levels yet we're not at this point in the game uh, the only reason I've come here is to just show you something very quickly after this we're gonna head back to uh, endless stairs what these, these stairs can't possibly be endless there's no way <sighs> yeah endless my ass Sounds what so? Ugh. So tired. Where do these stairs end? Hold on, let's turn around. Where the hell am I? Where am I? What? 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 Hold on. What the heck? What is going on? I'm not going any further. These stairs must be endless. Which means we need to get 70 power stars in order to unlock this secret. Har har har, there's such a secret. Why would you show me as I'm leaving? Why would you... Stupid. God dang. Alright, anyways. We're gonna head uh, back down to... What's that level called? Dire Dire Docks. And we're gonna finish up as much as I possibly can in that level. Um, should I get the 100 coin star? Nah. I'm gonna say... Hmm. This is gonna be a hard one. I guess I could just head out, go grab the metal... Nah, nah, nah. Not yet. Because then I have to do backtracking and all this other crap. It's cool. So I think we're just going to head into Dire Dire Docks and do as much as we can in that level. And I'm going to save the 100 coin star, I think. For Actually, you know what? No, I'm going to get the 100 coin star when I can collect the 8 red coins. Which is right now. So we're going to collect all 100 coins now. Or 100 star... Or 100 coins or whatever. Get 100 coins in total. And there's a manta. I think that's what that thing's called. A manta ray or something. I, I'm i not very good with my uh, aquatics at all. That's a shark. I know that. That's one mean-ass looking shark. Holy. Shigeru Miyamoto. Holy, man. You know how to make some sharks look mean, bro. 
Holy bro, look at that. It's smiling evilly and shit. Oh, oh, oh. that's an intense looking motherfucker. I wouldn't want I wouldn't want to be in an alley with that thing. Let's just say that. I would not want to be in an alley. It looks like if it had to kill, it would. And if it had to rape, it could. And I just don't want I don't I don't really like my chances. I'm not much of a gambling man. And um as far as putting my life in danger with a shark, I really don't think that's going to happen anytime soon. At all. At all, I don't think. I don't even think if it was a fake shark, I'd, I'd risk my life with a shark. A not real shark. A, like Jaws or something, I don't know. Or even if I was like in a cage, like Mythbusters and shit. And those guys are crazy from Mythbusters. They like, they bathe in meat and shit and go in shark tanks. I'm like, what the fuck, you crazy motherfuckers! I know it's for science and shit, but goddamn! Cover yourself in meat and shit, man. Why don't you go do that with a lion? That lion will fuck you right up. You lucky sharks are gay. Actually, sharks aren't gay. Except for the San Jose sharks. Ha 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 ha, it's a hockey team. Did you see what I did, did there? They stink. I don't like the San Jose sharks. Ah, uh, They're too good, I think. Whew, I just had to itch my eye. That's pretty annoying when you have to itch your eye. It's one of the worst. I ears and uh it, that, this is the order i think it goes ears because you have to lift your headset up then i think it goes eyes because you have to stop looking at the game and then i think it's nose but nose you really only have to take your hand off the controller and i mean either way you have to take your hand off the controller if you want to itch either of those properly except for with your eye with your eye you kind of just have to bring your hand towards your eye so that's not that bad but still like it's kind of kind of a waste of time i think but whatever. I'm just rambling. I'm a rambling, gambling man. Rambalin, gambalin, man. All right. Did I see a coin in that motherfucker? Nope. Didn't see any coins. No coins. No coins. Looking for coins. Can you spare a dime, Mr. Clam? You can spare a turtle shell. Oh, I finally know what these things do. Oh my goodness. I don't even remember where I learned, but I learned from somewhere that you can actually grab a turtle shell. I had no freaking clue. I have no idea where I learned this. I forget, but I just know you can pick up a turtle shell, and that's all I know. And I'm dead, so it doesn't matter. That's fucking lame. So I'm gonna off-screen to get 43 coins again, so I'll be right back. Alright guys, welcome back. Hold on, one second. Okay, I think I'm good. Um, so now that we're back at this clam and one coin short, because I don't know why, I'm too lazy to go look for one coin anyways, it doesn't really freaking matter. Anyways, this this just basically, it just helps you swim faster. And that was pretty neat, I found. I found this to be very neat. And then it's gone, and it's no longer here. But oh well, at least we got that. At least we got those coins. We're gonna head over here now, because I think there's a, some coins over here, I'm not sure. Could be wrong. I mean, how often is Shots ever right about anything? It's very rare. Um, pretty sure, though, because Shigeru Miyamoto's like, Hey, let's put coins near this big black freaking hole. That sucks ya into the big black freaking hole. Alright, grab this. Alright, get out of here. Okay, we're out of there. We're good. We're out of the current. Whew. Uh, I'm an alright button masher. I'm s- I sh- I'm sh- I'm sh- yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm pretty shit, uh, when it comes to, like, um... Canary Mary and Nintendo 64 button mashing. Or, like, Mario Party, but... Other button mashers I'm alright with, like, uh... Beat em ups and stuff, or fighting games. I'm really good with fighting games. Especially Tekken 4 on the PS2. I used to love that freaking game. I played as, uh... Martial Law. I don't know, he was some fucking karate ninja fucking guy. I don't care, he did flips and shit, so it was cool enough. <laughs> but yeah, that's how I kicked ass, was using martial law, just doing flips and shit. That's how you kick ass in Tekken. Use martial law and just do flips and shit. And then there was this other girl, I don't remember her name, I think it's like Christy or something. And she did like fucking three fucking, I don't even know, she did like breakdancing moves in order to kick ass. That was pretty cool too, she was a good character. I never really got the hang of her though. My friend did, though, whenever he came over and played as her. He actually, like, always kicked my ass. Even though, you know, like, I'm an expert at Tekken. Like, I've owned most of the Tekkens. Um, I, I own, like, the first, I think, three or something. And then I got the fourth one. And then I think that's all the Tekkens I collected. I'm not sure. 
you don't quote me on that. Like, I haven't gotten the new Tekken that came out, like Tekken 6 or 5 or something, I'm not sure. Frick! I forgot, you had to do some platform jumping here. Pretty intense platform jumping, too. Bam. Alright. Bam. Alright. Now I'm just gonna fall off, because I just don't really feel like, uh, jumping off. Because that's a really big risk that I just don't feel like taking. And this is 30 co- holy shit, I didn't know this was 30 coins worth. Holy. Alright. Bang. Alright, back down. Bang. Alright. Wow, I'm doing pretty well. Not gonna lie. I'm actually doing better than I thought I was gonna do with this segment. I'm normally not that great, but you know what? I'm doing alright. I'm doing alright. I could be doing a lot worse, is basically what I'm saying. That's some water. I'm drinking water out of a coffee mug. I know, right? That's how ghetto fabulous I am. Coffee out of... I mean, water out of a coffee mug. Yeah. Oh! Whoo! That was a almost not jump. Ooh, okay. So obviously you have to get it on the way back. Cause you gotta be a legit gangster. Or not. Okay, I don't know when you grab this thing right here. Probably eventually. It's pro you probably gotta jump at it while it's moving. That'd be lame. Yep, you gotta do that. Alright, grab that red coin. Grab this red coin. And... Shit! Aw, oh, I gotta get all the way back there. Might as well off screen. I'll figure out how much time I'm at. So I'll see you guys when I'm back at that plat at that pole. See ya. All right, guys, I'm back, and we're gonna get this last coin right here and grab a hundred coin star as well as the uh, red coin star by grabbing this last coin right here. And I'm kind of running low on time, but I think I could get a couple more stars in maybe. I could probably finish up this area in, um, or well, at least all we can do in this area in the next three or four minutes. Hopefully. I'm, I don't feel like jinxing it because I'm not much of a, I'm not really all that much like, um, what's the word I'm looking for? I'm pretty superstitious. I always jinx myself. That's what I'm saying. Like I was playing, um, what game was I playing? I was playing Mario Kart Double Dash with some friends and every freaking time I was in first, I swear to you, those like, I don't even know what they're called, those blue shells. The ones with the wings on them and they attack the person in first place. Every freaking race, oh my goodness. I got hit by that thing four times in one freaking race. Four freaking times. I was like, what? Why did I hand up in here? What? I'm just gonna kill myself, I don't care. That's what I get for getting off top or for talking and stuff. I don't know why I ended up in here. I should grab that first life. Did I grab it? Oh, I almost did. Oh, I grabbed it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah! It's like I didn't even lose a life. That is shots glitching the game for ya. Anyways, we're gonna head, out, head back in here. Through the jet stream. I know exactly which one this one is. I think. Alright guys, um... So I tried getting the one star, but I can't get it without the metal cap. I'm sure there's a way you can do it without the metal cap, but I can't do it. And also... I did have footage recorded of me trying to get it, and I was going to make a montage of it, which I s might be able to do still, but I think I lost all that footage, so I'm not able to. We'll have to see how that works. I'm not sure. I'm not sure at all. Anyways, uh, I'm going to get this star, because this is the last one that I know of that we can get in here, because we got that 100 coin star. And other than that, there's really nothing left to do, so... Okay, no, this is getting stupid. Why can't I get through these rings? We're almost out of time, Manta. Manta, listen. It's like the man sant. Oh, God. Come on. Yes. Okay, now I gotta get the fourth one, which I'm not gonna get, am I? Oh, I got it. Barely. Get the fifth? Nope, not getting the fifth. Oh, well. What? Am I not going through these or something? Like, am I going through these wrong? I don't know why I'm not getting through these rings. This is kind of stupid to me. Oh, well. Get through that ring. Get through that ring and get through this ring. There you go. There's a star. Right over the whirlpool, too. Anyways, guys, this is going to conclude it, uh, part 13. Thank you guys for tuning in. I will see you... I don't know if it's part 13. Don't quote me on that. I'll see you guys around for the next part, alright? Peace.